If your model is retopologized, come to a high subdivision level and delete the lower. You can reconstruct subdiv at the end. Draw a black line where you want the hair line to be. Now draw a grid of squares within the hair line, and there's a trade off with this. The smaller the squares, the more control you will have, but also the longer the grooming process will take. When you're ready, Come to Z plugin, polygroup it, polygroup it from paint borderless. We now have a grid of polygroups. Hide the face and grow the selection using Ctrl Shift X until all of the black border is visible and fill it with the skin colour to get rid of it. Mask the grid and come to Fibre Mesh Preview and play with the settings to your liking. If you come to Document Anti Alias Tarf, you get a cleaner view of the fibres. When you're ready, hit accept and notice how the hair is now in polygroups. Come to brush, auto masking and turn mask by polygroups up to 100. You can now use your grooming tools to manipulate each section of our original grid individually, allowing for greater control. If you enjoyed this to- oh crap.